Well, McIntyre, quite a quiet front nine compared with his playing partner, Soren Kelton. But he was still out in 33. Oh, hello. That'll speed things up slightly. We go to 12 in McIntyre. Nicely done by Robert McIntyre. Moves to eight under. Oh, that's got to be close. Oh, you dog. Oh, could you stay out? I'd have to call for a ruling. Up to 14, the par three, 193 yards for Robert McIntyre. Yeah, yeah. All the way back there. Yeah, yeah. All the way back. Another absolute gem from the Scottish rookie on the European tour. Now to 14 and McIntyre for birdie. Beautiful tee shot on this par three. To get within one of the lead. Yeah. Oh, menacing as well Scottish golf has waited a long time for a kind of new superstar hasn't it since uh, Colin Montgomery and McIntyre to get to 10 under and within one of Kitayama at the 15th fun game it is quite going out Many birdies on the back nine. All of a sudden, it's McIntyre who's got the good feelings going towards the end of his day. McIntyre at the par three, 16. T way back at 16 today. They've also the T way up as well as the hole cut way at ah. the back of the green. McIntyre second to the par three, 16th here, coming out of the long rough. A little bit of a downhill lie. It's a tough one. Oh, landed very softly. You can see the slope of the green there from right to left as you play the hole, left to right from where we were looking. McIntyre for par. We saw the nice chip from left to the green. It's a little left to right. Which is a good type of break for a left-handed player. Pours it right in the middle. Remains one behind the lead of Kitayama. One here for McIntyre. He likes the flop shot. He suits his style though, plays it off the back foot. Likes to hold the face going through the rough. That's a good shot. Shots right. that well off a couple of tears. Back to 17. McIntyre, uphill birdie putt. Also to tie Kitayama. Quite a good lie here for McIntyre. We'll be pretty much going at this one. Too bad, a little bit of release coming out of the rough, but it's okay. Good strong hole to finish. It's gone to 18. And Robert McIntyre for a closing birdie. So close, almost to 63. Robert McIntyre, hopefully. This is for a round of 64. And that has hurtled him up the field. Three times a second this year. What a rookie season. Bobby, some moving day. Just give us your assessment of how things went today. Yeah, it was good. It went as probably as good as it could. Um, definitely any shot slip, really. Um, just picked up the shots where I, where I knew I could, and I got quite lucky on 10, which it was happy to sneak away with. I was going to say, I've seen some good recovery shots from you this week. That must be really pleasing. Yeah, it's, a, it's not the style of grass that I like. Um, I just I went to uni in the States, um, in Louisiana, and that... <laughs> It's the same kind of grass, the Bermuda, so I know how to play it and 
I'm just trying to play my own game, and if it if it's good, it's good. If it's not, well, we'll go on to the next one. I see you and Simon had a bit of a ding dong battle out there today. Did it did it help and how he was playing well at the same time? Yeah, he was unbelievable early on. I mean, he was just he was just holding putts from all over the place, chipping in. But his long arms were unbelievable, and it, I was just saying to Greg, right, let's, let's just hold on to him. Um, managed to do that, and then I, I got away with a few on the way in. Obviously a good result this week can push you towards the, the top ten now on the race to Dubai. That must be absolutely like, pleasing for you in your debut season as well. Yeah, I'm not, I mean, I'm not really. It's the world ranking right now. I'm just trying to, I'm trying to run up that as fast as I can. Um, tend the season really high. Um, but, I mean, obviously race Dubai, if I get in a position coming into the last three, well, you go for gold, don't you? To watch another European Tour video, click here. And to subscribe, click here.